Now, there continues to be a significant need for behavioral health workers around San Diego County. We have a huge shortage as projected. Right, about 18,000 health care workers, uh, behavioral health workers that would be needed. So that's why in just a few hours, local leaders, current employees will all be gathering to talk about how they not only want to bring in more workers, but retain them. That's key to this. CBS 8's Chris Grow live at the County Administration Building to explain what they could be doing there. Good morning. Yeah, good morning. So this group of elected leaders, as well as those in the behavioral health fields, are going to be discussing strategies to try to fix this issue because that 18,000 number, that shortage, that's projected over the next five years. So that is something that is pressing, and that is something that they would like to see happen right now. Now, a reason why we are seeing that shortage being estimated is because it has to deal with the population growth that our area it could experience and the fact that so many behavioral health specialists could be leaving the industry. Now, according to the county, they have about 17,000 workers in their current workforce, but they admit that they're still about 8,000 short right now to meet that current demand. So think about it. Within the next five years, they're estimating that they need to hire more workers than they already have at this moment. So in order to combat that, those county supervisors, leaders, as well as others in the industry are meeting later today in just about a little less than three hours, so at 8.30 our time. And at this gathering, the plan is to figure out how to address this problem and advance a strategy aimed at fixing it. Now, CBS 8 spoke with an economist with the San Diego Workforce Partnership last week about this issue, and they told us that one way you could attract more workers is by paying them more and trying to lessen that demanding workload, as so often they are on the front line of a lot of the issues issues that so many people experience. If we can pay them well, and if we can um, give them a manageable caseload, um, then I think we can, we'd be a destination place for folks to, to do this kind of work. And this meeting will be happening downtown and we will continue to cover it for any updates, any formal plans that could be advanced out of this meeting. Eric and Netta.